After a gut-wrenching loss to Ohio State, hope's still alive for the Fighting Irish to make the college football playoff. Yeah, the Countdown's George Mele spoke with fans on how they're feeling after the Irish escaped with a win in this week's Buzz Around Campus. We hit the Notre Dame campus on a brilliant fall Friday and quickly found a fully confident Mark LeBeau. Oh, I'm feeling fantastic. You know, obviously, uh, we had a lot had a lot of night games lately. It's been a little, you know, discombobulated, but I think we're right on track to, for a good win. Louisville, 25, not a problem. The father of this positively perfect baby girl is understandably confident. Yeah, feeling really good. I mean, Notre Dame's, Notre Dame's coming in off of a good win um, against Duke last week, which was an awesome game to see. Um, I'm feeling pretty good about them going into beating Louisville this week and then going onward to uh, USC the following week here at home. So uh, it should be a good one. Honestly, I'm a Michigan fan, so I want Notre Dame to lose. If I was a reporter worth my salt, I might have noticed that you were wearing a Michigan sweatshirt. <laughs> <laughs> I have to confess, before Lamar Jackson came along, I didn't actually know Louisville had a football program. This degenerate railbird only thinks of one thing when he hears the word Louisville. They're off in the Kentucky Derby. Turns out Eleanor Hansen is nearly as horse obsessed as this reporter. Yeah, there's Churchill Downs, there's lots of good bourbon, <laughs> a big horse girl. That's what I pay attention to. <laughs> you, you and I are like-minded then. Yes. So. Giddy up for countdown to kickoff. This is George Mallet. 